Hello everyone. So today I received something from Amazon. Um, I'm an Amazon Prime member, so it was uh, free shipping. It was just ten dollars. And uh, let me show you exactly what I received. It is the Rune Uros, um, and it's by the company Exotic Dream. Um, it's a magic talisman, I guess you could say, and it is. Uh, it's made out of pewter. And um, the Rune Uros uh, basically is how we got the small letter in, and um, it also has to do with something very, very deep within humanity, uh, original primordial strength, prehistoric strength, um, that, that basically does symbolize those strong Arachs. Uh, the Arach is the animal that uh, basically makes up the root word, well, the name Arach makes up the root word, Uros, uh, and um, the Arachs were uh, basically big oxes, uh, over seven feet tall, that we hunted to extinction before even recorded history. Um, usually in, nor well, in Northern Europe, uh, I'm not sure if they were in other places, but the Auroch was in Northern Europe, um, and they were very strong animals, and they were, and they were hunted to extinction at a time when humanity relied on primordial, basic strength, um, creative strength from, uh, from our very life force. Um, it, it can represent, uh, I guess you could say fertility, um, a, uh, 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 connection to to the wild to our our animal nature but uh it, if used properly um can basically be said to uh, be a rune of strength of uh of ancient strength of long thought strength of um intrinsic strength to uh humanity um we had very much connection to animals in the past and we still do uh and we we tend to forget that side of us that primordial strength of the hunt but also um, how that animal meant so much to us when they were our our uh, source of food. Um, and this is still true nowadays. Um, Uros is part of the Elder Futhark alphabet. Um, these are, I guess you could say, Nordic or Viking runes. Uh, they come, these are runes, the Elder Futhark comes from uh, the northernmost parts of Europe. And um, we get a lot of our English letters from the runes, but... Um, Moving on, what came with Uros, this uh, pewter talisman, a uh, magical talisman, is a uh, a very nice blue velvet bag that I would recommend keeping it in when you're not wearing it. And I wore it throughout the day today to kind of give it some connection to me, give it a little bit piece of my life force so that it can be brought to life. Uh, but I'm going to be doing uh, a charging of this rune, uh, a blessing of it, if you will. Uh, so that it can operate to a greater degree uh, in the future for me. Uh, I will be charging some water uh, pu with purified water and salt, uh, specifically sea salt, in the, the cup that I use to purify water. I'll be meditating very briefly and uh, imagining uh, light coming from me and into the water, into this salted water that I salted myself, and then I will be uh, dipping Uros this Uros pendant, into that water so that it is blessed, so that any energies it might have accumulated over time before it reached me uh, are cleansed. And um, I found that talismans don't necessarily need to be like silver or gold or some co or some high-priced material in order to work. A lot of my talismans are pewter, and as long as you charge them correctly, there's a whole bunch of different ways to charge talismans, um, they can work for you just like uh, a more expensive talisman. I mean, this was only ten dollars, and it came with Prime. Got it in two days from Exotic Dream once again, and um, I really love the smooth surface. Um, it's something that you would want to like touch and kind of run your hand around. And um, the cord is done with a knot that I love to see on talismans when you when you order them. It's uh it's an adjustable an adjustable cord that is tied in such a way that has a wide range of adjustment and it's just it's just the cord tied this way but it's a really nice touch whenever a talisman comes with a cord like this uh and uros has a special significance to me it is a rune i have great uh, association with it feels like a scorpio rune if if you will and uh this and ansels um are two runes that I'm very close to. They are, the runes are ancient spirits, primordial spirits, the gods of the gods, if you will. Um, just at, just before things started to form, these uh, these primordial, primordial forces started to combine and then form everything. And Uros is one of them. Uh, I'll go ahead and put up the information and how it looks on Amazon right here. And um, 
hey, if you want to use any part of this ritual, feel free to. This is how I'm going to do it. Uh, after I basically charge the water, dip it in that water, and uh, take it out of the water, I'm going to go outside, plunge uh, my hand into the earth with the pendant in my hand, and make that sign, Uros, because basically grabbing the earth is kind of what the what the symbol is, Uros, because you're like digging, to, digging into the earth like a primordial ancestor who was very close to the earth, just digging into it for that, um, that strength, that primordial energy uh, flowing from the earth into oneself. Uh, because the Aurochs that we hunted to extinction lived off the earth, we lived off them, and the, all these strengths between us, the animal, and the earth are very much connected. So um, I'll go ahead and charge the water. I'll go to another part of the video where I charge the water, dip it in, and then um, after that I will go outside. But um, I will see you in just a second. Purify this water in the name of my ancestors and in the name of the gods. So mote it be. Light fills this water. Salt purifies it. And holds it. That anything put into it may be purified of all negative energy. As no negative energy can live in this water. There is only light here, only light, only light. I see the light fill this water. I direct the light through myself. travels in my blood, it is created by the very seed of divinity in my heart, and it is pumped in my blood, and the light fills this water, for I will it to. Oros. may all negative energy be cleansed from you that you may be a receptacle for light and as you are blessed may you be my strength may you provide me with nothing but strength willpower and a connection to the streams of energy running through reality since time immemorable since time's primordial. For Uros, 
You are a spirit, ancient and old. You are one of the gods of the gods. One of the divine elements. Provide me with a conduit as a conduit to that strength and give me strength, Duros. This is your purpose. This is what you will do for me. So mote it be. You are cleansed, Uruz. You are purified. Now it is time to make contact with the earth. Ulus, you are now blessed. She may serve me as a powerhouse of strength. Thank you, Ulus. May this talisman be a representation of you. So mote it be. <laughs> 